Hey guys, this is Aaron with Vacant Land Guys. Just wanted to do another quick video here for you. Go check it out here. Just got uh, two and a half acres in Mojave, California. Uh, nestled between the Soledad Mountain and Rosamond Hill. Let's go take a look. Uh, that's just a view in the evening. Some nice cloud cover there. Let me fix that picture. Real quick. Anyway. Two and a half acres, in Mojave County, uh, California. Uh, got some great, spectacular mountain views here on this flat residential land. Uh, we are asking all cash discount of one thousand nine hundred ninety-eight dollars, or terms. We got a sweet terms deal on this one. Hundred down and hundred month for forty-eight months at zero percent interest and no fees. You can just click right here on this link. I'll take you the check out and you can just plug in all your information right here you know, automatically charge your credit card every month uh, put in your tax address, your contact uh, this is optional stuff if you want to put it in there uh, yeah we'll make it pretty easy to uh, buy from us except credit cards, bank wire transfers cashiers checks, money orders you can buy the property right on our website like I was saying um, We'll do owner financing on just about all of our properties. Just uh, ask us and we'll, we can work something out with you. Uh, yeah, Mojave's a neat little town, slowly growing. Uh, they're uh, about two, I don't know, about an hour and 45 from uh, L downtown LA and uh, in the San Fernando Valley, it's about 45 minutes without any traffic um, your uh... this property is just uh... south of uh... mojave actually let me just take a look here real quick so this is the property right here it's this little area right here this little section here so you got road you got a dirt road coming in here you can probably get along you know, on here and this I'll, I'll take you to google earth and we'll check it out these uh, these pictures were pretty close to the property. This is pulled these right off of this. There's a road that runs here, and then one over here. So I pulled these properties or these images right off of there. So this is kind of what you're going to be looking at. These pictures about I don't know a quarter mile away. So that's what you're going to be. This is what you're going to be seeing around here. This this one, this one, this one, and these are this is areas around. You guys are going to be seeing this as the roads coming in. Here's just some uh, maps I pulled up to give you some ideas of your times and everything, how far you're going to be driving. But, uh, yeah, here's all the pertinent details. Price, $1,998. Or we can do terms, uh, 100 down, 100 a month. Uh, here's your GPS coordinates. Some Kern County. Your your power. It's power line kind of nearby. I'm not sure how far away it is, but it's in the area. There's houses around you. Um, septic or alternative system taxes are 101 and 53 cents a year. 199 closing dock fee. Clear title. Uh, it's your property ID. Size of your property. APN. General elevation. Is your zoning residential vacant? Uh, water, a little bit about us. Anyway, let's go over to uh, Google Earth here. Just fly you in, show you where you are. Whoop. Here we are. So here's LA. I lost stuff on here. So here's LA. You got you know, Lancaster's really close by, so you can get everything you need there. There's Home Depot and uh, Walmart and all that good stuff. It's about 28 minute drive. Uh, yeah, you just come right up in here. Just drive right up through the San Fernando Valley, right over here. I think you can even go through here. Yeah, it looks like a road. Yeah, you can take the 14 right up through here. Get there pretty quick. Uh, so here's the property. Here's Mojave. Here's Rosamond. There's a lot of stuff you can get there. Here's where the property is. It's pretty cool. This is uh, oh, the uh, Soledad Mountain here. 
So you're kind of at the base of that between Soledad Mountain and uh, Rosamond Hills here. And then you got another little area over here. So you kind of you're surrounded pretty much by uh, all these little mountains and hills and everything. Got some little hills over here and stuff. So kind of down this little valley area here. Just fly, fly you in here. So here's a property. Come in on uh so come in on this on 14 here. Make a left. Come down this road here. Make another left on uh what's this one called? That's a little dirt road. Oh, there's nothing there. I can tell you right here, but oh, there it is. Uh oh. Werner Avenue. So make left on Werner. Then another left. Down. That looks like a little trail you can come right in on here. And, uh, back to your property. Right here. It's just going to fly you down. Looks like there's some little. I don't know what these little structures are here. But, uh, get you down on ground level. So this is what you're going to be looking at. I mean, that's pretty amazing view right there. The Soledad Mountains. Um, just fly around. Try not to make it too sick. So you got these little hills all around you. The mountains. And this is facing this is facing south. Got some more little mountains way off in the range there. And, uh, that little green area, that means that's a national forest. Not sure what I've names all of those are. Lots of green areas back there. You're kind of in the desert right here. Well, you are in the desert, you're in the Mojave Desert. And some more mountains. Let's see um, those hills I was talking about. I can't remember the name of them off the top of my head. And then, uh, yeah, you drive a little bit further out, you start getting up in some greener areas. And you got some more mountains over here. Yeah, pretty neat little spot. Um, looks like there was a house here at one point. I don't know what that is. Looks like it's gone. Whatever it is, it's just mostly demolished and shambles. But you see, you got neighbors here in the area. Uh, I see a power pole right there. Another power pole right there. So there's power in the area. It's running along here or something. Yeah, power pull there, power pull there, power pull there. I didn't see anything, any power pulls running along here. But that doesn't mean, well, that doesn't mean there's not power there, but I'm not seeing anything, guys. Um, this looks like it might be, could be fenced, I'm not sure. This looks like a fence line here and here, but I haven't been to this one. So it's hard to say. Uh, but it looks like it's easy to get to. I mean, just come in here or maybe even drive along here. You know, here it's zoned uh, vacant residential. Uh, I always double check with the county, though. Um, I got on their website, called them up. They said it was, you could build on it, but just make sure to call them up, double check anyway. Um, there's power here. There's definitely power running on this road. You can see the power poles. Here. Well, there's power in the area. It's not too far away. Oh, I might want to go off grid for now or maybe park the RV on it or something. Uh, yeah. Let's uh, look at some pictures. So, this is the Mojave Desert. It's the Mojave Desert, but whatever. Some pictures. Check this out. More prospectors. Oh, there's there's a little gold mine up here. I guess. You can go uh, do some prospecting. That's kind of cool. You got a house. Sheep flock.
it's like a movie set. It's kind of cool. Might still be around. Hello. Yeah. That's kind of cool. A Mercury shop. You got a little airstrip here. That's kind of cool. Nice little drive. Solar panels all around here. I guess this area is uh, more solar here. This area has tons of uh, renewable energy uh, all around it. I think this is all wind turbines here. Yeah, that's all wind. Wind turbines and solar. A lot of... Uh, so if you wanted to go off grid, this would be a great place to do it. Uh, or just invest in this land and maybe sell your property back to the uh, solar companies or set up wind turbines. I don't know. You have to check in with all that, but uh, I mean, it's people are doing it, so it's possible. Uh, yeah, that's kind of it in a nutshell. Give us a call or uh, jump on our website. Check out right there. Uh, this is Aaron with Fake It Lane, guys. 971-225-7024. Uh, Thanks for watching.